I make work about biracial identity. These are some images uh, of me as a kid. When I was younger, my grandfather asked my mother, where's that little pickaninny at? I'm toying around with this word pickaninny. Uh, it's, it's a journey through my thoughts and feelings around this word and my personal story and the history of that word in America. You know, I'm, I'm biracial. I have a black parent and a white parent. I don't know my black parent, who's my father. I'm light complected. I used to have an afro. And so my hair, you know, depending on how my hair was as a kid, you know, people saw my ethnicity in various ways. And that's a space that when I was growing up wasn't you know, I didn't see people that look like me on the TV. I didn't see people that look like me in the world. And so I think another reason why I make this work is because I think it's important to see yourself in the world. There's a black context, a white context, but there's a lot of us that are in the middle of that or kind of straddle both or neither. Uh, so I hope to complicate those conversations. Um, and I think being vulnerable, allowing yourself to, to tell your story, um, you know, allows for other people to see themselves.